Welcome back in, highlighting Asian flavors like white rabbit candy, black sesame, matcha, and more. Always Yours Bakery is a big hit. They offer a modern space where people can hang out and enjoy a dessert and a milk tea. So here to share more and to show us how to decorate macarons, our owner of Always Yours Bakery, Natalie Wong, and cake decorator, Dimitri Palu. Thank you all so much for being here. Thank you for having us. Thank you. We're excited to have you. This display smells really good, so Thank I'm excited you. about it because we love to taste food on the show. Um, so first, I want you to kind of tell me your story and how you got started. Yeah, so I started baking macarons in 2013, and I actually learned on YouTube. So I didn't go to pastry school or anything. I was just baking at home at my parents' house in Oakland mm -hmm. where my dad was helping me deliver orders and my mom was helping me wash dishes. Oh. Yeah, and then I just posted on Instagram, and then a lot of people started following me and asking to order. So I was like, sure, why not? Why not do that? So I did that as a side hustle for six years. And then in 2019, I quit my job at a corporate place, and then I was able to do this full time so I could pursue my passion and wow. eventually open a bakery, and I opened it in 2021. Okay, fabulous. So you've yeah. been doing this professionally fully for a few years now. Yeah, at yeah. least five years. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so does it kind of feel like a fulfillment of like a dream for you? You're like, wow, I never imagined I'd do something so fun, I imagine, right? Yeah, it's like a big accomplishment. I mean, it's a really hard thing to do, and I'm so happy that I did it. Awesome. Well, congratulations. Dimitri, I want to talk to you for a second. Tell me about what you do at the bakery. Yeah, so I'm one of the um, lead cake decorators. I'm the head baker. So we uh, take in charge of, of a lot of the main bulk of the baking. Um, and then, uh, of course, our cakes, we're, we're uh, very happy to be a part of many uh, of the celebrations in life that people have from weddings to graduations to anniversaries. Um, and so it's, it, we're always excited when people choose us uh, to make their cakes and their desserts. Awesome. C uh, did you make this cake right here with I the did. beautiful decor? So pretty. Yes. This is so in. What would you call this? Like a vintage style uh, cake? Yeah, vintage heart okay. cake. Yeah, this is very trendy and very People demure, are... very mindful. Very demure. <laughs> yes. We yes. talked about that last week on the show. Um, people are so into this kind of vintage cake right now. I tried to make one for my friend's birthday and I did a massive fail. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, but it's pretty it's, hard. It's the effort that counts, right? Mm -hmm. um, tell me a little bit about your flavors and how you guys choose those, which ones are best to go into something like a cake? Uh, so we do like more Asian inspired flavors mm -hmm. like hoji cha, matcha, black sesame, and ube. And wow. we try to highlight the Asian culture in more of our baked goods. And yeah. so I like to do that because I feel like there's not that many bakeries that do that. So unique. Yeah, you've kind of made mm -hmm. your own niche, right? Yeah. Which is perfect. Um, tell me a little bit about what we're looking at on the table today. Okay, so first we have our character macarons. Those are our most popular item and they're something that's very dear to my heart because uh -huh. I really like drawing. So I just made art into uh, edible art. So how did you pick these ones specifically? Do you have favorites? Um, yeah, I really <laughs> like bears and frogs. They're like really trendy right now. And corgis are also very popular and I love dogs. And then dumplings, because, you know, Asian, and we yeah. fill them with a white rabbit candy buttercream. What does that taste like? It Can tastes you like it to um, condensed milk. Okay, delicious. Yeah. I like it already. Yeah. That's wonderful. Um, so do you ever have people say, like, I want my dog. Can you make my dog? Oh, yeah. <laughs> we have that all the time. And you can do that? Yeah. Oh, cool. And we also make dog treats, too. Mm -hmm. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. You do and it dog all. cakes. Yes. Wonderful. Okay, so uh, is this a dog cake? Oh, no. 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 <laughs> <laughs> like, that's a really nice dog cake. Oh, uh, no. Um, what about the cake flavor, can you tell me? So this is our classic vanilla. Uh, very simple, but you know, a lot of people like vanilla. Mm -hmm. uh, but we offer a lot of different flavors, like Natalie was mentioning, uh, from matcha to hoji cha to ube, a lot of Asian-inspired flavors. Um, and then cookies and cream, is, which is a classic. Uh, but so this one right now is va uh, just plain vanilla. Okay, wonderful, sounds delicious. Mm -hmm. um, we have a project here, it looks like, on yeah. the table with the pandas. So can you tell me what we're gonna be doing with them? So we're going to be decorating the pandas and okay. make it look like this one right here. Awesome. Okay. And then we're going to fill them with the black sesame buttercream. Okay, perfect. Can yeah. you show me, uh, let's start, show me what to do okay. here. So you grab a macaron okay. shell. Okay. Yep. And then you take the black icing and then you're going to make an eye in the center of the... Oh, the outside of yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> so this is like the panda markings. Cute. Yeah. Okay, cool. And then you're going to put a little nose like this. And then okay. little mouth like that. So it already came with the markings. Yeah. You helped me out a bit. Okay, can yeah. I give it a go? Let <laughs> yeah, me try. Go ahead. Let's see how well I can do. Mm -hmm. So you did an eye. Yep, an eye. And then another eye. Yep. 
Okay. Oh, <laughs> that's okay. I like how you're both still nose. gonna taste good. But I mess it up at the same time. Okay, so for the nose, you did like a. It's like a little kind triangle. Of a, kind of a dot. Oh, and make then it a little lower, but uh, <laughs> it's a messed up panda it's bear. It's okay. And that's it's okay. A little mouth It'll right still there. taste delicious. Yeah. Oh, that's the mouth. I see. Yeah, <laughs> it's like a three. <laughs> oh, well, mm -hmm. yours is like a three. Mine yeah. is. Like a, who knows? Oh, that what. still works. It's so cute. I still know what it is. Yeah, you still know what it is. Okay, um, so. And then we're then gonna what? do uh, the little pink blush for the okay. cheeks to make it cutesy and demure, you know? <laughs> it's so in, I'm telling you I guys. Know. Let me just take that off right there and then just make a little Aww. oval on each side of the eye. Okay, mm -hmm. did you hear we had someone say that pandas were their favorite animal to, uh, to oh, see today? at the yeah, zoo? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, they're so cute. They're so cute. They're yeah. just like, Okay, here, I'm trying that works. to show Very it. Nice. I'm trying Aww. to show it as I do it, so I'm gonna blame that. Yeah, it does look cute. It has yeah. a sweet little personality, yeah, I think. It has okay. The little cheeks. Okay, we've got pink. And okay, then what's now next? we're gonna fill the bottom. The so you take part. the other shell. Okay. And then you're just gonna squeeze like a dollop like this much. Okay. Wow, mine then, sure does look different from yours. Oh yeah, yours is a little bit smaller. Sometimes that happens. Oh no, I meant my decor. Oh, I know it's okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah, how so much? About that much. I okay. like to do a lot of filling. Okay, yeah. Give, we don't want to skimp give on the, the people customers. what they want. Yeah, yes. exactly. <laughs> okay, so yeah. we put some filling. And tell me again what this filling ta is. What's it's the taste? Black sesame. Black sesame. Okay, mm -hmm. wonderful. And then you're just gonna put it down and then kind of twist this it. This is cute because mine looks like it has a kind of. This kind of looks like a tail. Yeah, <laughs> that's it has so a black cute. butt. Yeah, I love it. Yeah, yeah, a little yeah. black behind. Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. very cool. Yeah. Okay, love it. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then this is the finished product. Okay, Dimitri, what do you think? Did I, did I make you it? Did. Uh, it's <laughs> probably, you did. It's better. Would you know it's a panda? I would. It's, it's a very panda. cute. All right, yeah. can I give it a taste? Yeah. Okay, I want to taste. Cheers. Cheers. Okay. Hmm. Mm. It tastes delicious. Yeah, it has the crunch and then it's like soft and fluffy inside. So good. Mm hmm. Mm. Yeah. Mm hmm. Oh, love it. Okay, wonderful. So if people want to try, these gorgeous macaroons tell us how they can do it. Mm -hmm. Well, if they want to try, then they can come to our bakery in Castro Valley. Yeah. And we have 12 different flavors as shown here. This is cookies and cream, mm. fruity pebbles, white rabbit candy, salted caramel, strawberry cheesecake, hazelnut chocolate, passion fruit, tiramisu, jasmine milk tea. That one's really popular. Ooh. It's Asian flavor. Uh huh. And then. Pistachio, matcha Oreo, and ube. And they all look beautiful too. I mean, the colors are just so pretty. You've done such a good job, you guys. Congratulations Thank you. on all your success. Thank you.